It's time for another edition of Relics in Central New York. In the studio today, Nancy and Don Hartman from the Potting Shed Antique Store. What are we going to talk about today, Don? Well, we've been doing Relics of Central New York, and uh, I brought a couple coke trays, and they're not really indigenous to this area. Uh, you know, Coca-Cola is a national company, very highly collectible in that. But there's a particular reason I brought these two trays. Uh, we talk about our history, you know, here in Oneida County and that. And I have to say, these two trays are the most common in this area. And as I was a kid and picking up stuff, uh, I was happening to noticing that, you know, most of the Coca-Cola trays I got were from 1938 and 1952. Uh, what they call the yellow dress girl, and the, oh. this one is the uh, menu girl. And uh, I had an uh, older uh, dealer that used to mentor me. And finally I said to her, I said, Gloria, how come I keep finding in the Coke trays, I just keep finding these two particularly? She says, Don, she says, it's easy. She says, uh, Coca-Cola had a campaign where for their advertising, they would go choose areas and they would go through and they would drop off Coke trays at every home. And that was their way of advertising. So they came through Oneida County in 1938 they also came back in 1952. So these are gonna be the two most common trays that you will find in this area. Now outside the area or on eBay or that, uh, prices at one time were, were quite high for these. And uh, it was easy to pick up a 38 and throw it on eBay and make some decent money because at one time every household had one. Um, today we find that, that they're getting harder to find. Uh, the condition is, is not always as good as we'd want. Matter of fact, I had a better 1931 8 to bring, and I went downstairs to, to get it and realized that we had sold that one too. <laughs> but uh, they're interesting. Uh, they are trays that you will find uh, predominantly in this area. So when you find someone from the other years, from in the 40s and different 50s or 60s or that, uh, you can get excited because it's not a very common one to this area. Mm, interesting. Thanks so much, Don. That's another edition of Relics in Central New York with Don and Nancy Hartman from Potting Shed Antiques. Thanks, guys.